Hey there, this is Bob Rutledge with Micromanage Media, and today I'm going to talk about two ways to get your business on the market or, or out on the internet with a very low budget. One of them is involving the new Google Sites, and the other is involving, you know, with your Google My Business page, there is a free, it'll say website down in the lower left-hand part. I thought both of these services were the same, but they're not. And if you want to find out more, stay tuned to this video. Now, down in the uh, corner right there, there's a subscribe button. Please subscribe to it. Uh, from time to time, I do videos like this. It's not on a regular schedule, and it can never be enough. But, you know, over 20-something years on the Internet, I've learned a few things. And uh, one of them, I have delightfully, I mean, I almost did this job for free because I wanted myself to learn what how to do a Google website. I do all of my websites. Uh, you can see the one up on the TV behind me here. Uh, that was done on, uh, it's for a painting contractor. It was done for, um, it was done on WordPress. And I'm very familiar with WordPress. I enjoy designing on WordPress. Uh, I've learned a few skills and tips and tricks on how to do it. I don't know how to lay the pages out to uh, make the phone ring. I mean, that's the ideal thing. But you also have to get your website indexed, traffic to it, things like that. Well, I got contacted by a uh, sprinkler uh, repair guy. He's literally one guy. He, you know, he's just not a big business, doesn't have any kind of money to be spending on this stuff. And I said, man, for a, a tiny little money, I'll do it because I want to learn how to do this myself. And it really, it's turned out better than I thought it would. In fact, I'll be doing more websites like this in Google, the new Google Sites. Look it up. There's Google Sites and then there's the new Google Sites. And um, it's, a free, it's a way that everybody can build a free website uh, hosted forever for free. Uh, you still need to get your own domain name, but you can use the domain name that they will automatically generate for you. I just don't recommend it. It's not going to be something you're going to find easy to look up. So this gentleman already had his own domain name. And um, so I redesigned the website for me. This didn't one but a week ago or so. And now all the pages have been indexed. I love how they picked up on his service area. There was no metadata to fill out on this thing. Uh, Google just knew what to read on it. I am impressed beyond belief impressed. And so uh, I'm going to click the, then the other. So that's the new Google sites, not to be confused with Google My Business's website. And look right below here because here it is. It's already been indexed. I just did them both. I threw this in as a freebie because, again, I wanted to figure out how to do it. Was it a good deal? And um, you know, that's the beauty of what I do is I get to experiment. And um, so here's that page. So first of all, let's look at the website. And this is the website I did on, I love how it's got the parallax. I believe that's what you call that, the way it does that. Um, I put a couple of videos on here for him. Uh, some graphics. And I think there's probably 20 something web pages here. Um, I know I've got a services area, so Lawrenceville lawn sprinklers. And, um, you know, it was just, I won't say easy, but uh, it really wasn't. Uh, I mean, you, I think to make any website look good, you've got to really have done it a lot. Uh, it's hard. It's all about the graphics, getting the graphics. to. For instance, I spent a day just trying to find a graphic that would line up in the center like this one and still look good on a smartphone. Let's take a look and see what it looks like on a smartphone just for uh, the heck of it here. Let's go to developer tools. And so that's what it looks like on a smartphone. And as you can see, there's the phone number readily visible. We're open 24 hours a day. I, mean, I just love how the whole thing lays out. If you go to the navigation on this, uh, go back to the home page. There it is again. I love it. I, I experimented with laying out the phone number here and the title of the page here, and then the other one you saw it was just reversed. But either way, it looks great. And they have so many uh, features, I guess you'd call them, uh, 
you know, you, I could have put the title in this picture, could have done a lot of things. There's a million different variations. Well, there's thousands of variations. This is not, this is not going to replace WordPress for flexibility, but dead gum, the price for a small business person, I'm talking about a really small business guy. There's no hosting involved. This website's never going to get hacked because it's on Google servers. It's written by Google. Google's totally responsible for it. Uh, it is a way to go, if not the way to go for a really small company. I know some of y'all are really using your Facebook page as your website. Do both. Make this your website. Get a Facebook page. Get your domain name. Domain name's $12 a year. Uh, even the expensive ones are $30 or $40 a year. You need to have a domain name. Then here's the other part to this. This is uh, also... L. Freebo, Advanced Irrigation Lawn Sprinkler System Contractor dot business site. And this is part of the uh, Google My Business Network. And so let's click on that. And you can see that it's got a, a different header that I previously designed. And uh, if I had some updates to the post, they would show, well, this is what this is. This is a, a post that I did on this Google My Business page. Let me show you what I'm talking about here. So if you go back to, to this page, um, you should always be doing Google updates or hire someone like me to do Google updates for you. Now, the one that I did has expired, but it would normally show in this space. But you can click right here and see pictures and uh, the article, I, the little post, if I guess that's what you want to call it, shows up there. Now let's go back to that website and you will see. And if you had any reviews, which he doesn't have any reviews, they would show up automatically in this space here. So it's got his business hours, phone numbers, photographs. You can upload photographs all day long, and they'll show up here automatically. And uh, I, it's free. Google doesn't penalize you for having the two websites. Uh, I guess they kind of like it. So this is a way to go. But back to the uh, Google My the Google, the new Google website. Let's take a look again at uh, at all the pages that I've done on this thing. I mean, I'm just there were several different layouts. You have you can't you can change some of the basic colors, but you can't change um, some of the ways the backgrounds are highlighted. There's four four different templates, five different templates to choose from. Um, so you just have to play with those combinations. And, but you won't have any uh, say so about what font to use I, you know, uh, on any of those. They have fonts. They, they look good. Uh, I had a hard choice between this one and two or three of the other uh, templates that were already built into it. I decided I could play with it all day long and never make a final decision, so I just left it with what I'd had. It. But anyway, so this is all about Google, Google the new Sites by Google, websites by Google, the new version. It's free. It comes with every Gmail account has it. Um, Google My Business is what every business should have. Uh, it's how you get listed. Uh, it's, it's the, it's the uh, yellow pages, so to speak, about your business. Um, you need to update it often. You need to have name, address, and phone number on there. Uh, you, you've got to, if you know anything about Google My Business, you know, Google My Business, you have to get it verified. That means they have to send a piece of mail to your house to, or to your business location, but they send it to your house. And uh, every every good business, ought, I mean, every business ought to have one of those. And then you get that extra page that I was showing you here, even if you never did a website. And that will show up in this link where you see website here, that would take you to it. Right now, I've got it set to go to the website that I designed. Although, Google hasn't updated it yet because of this COVID virus thing. Um, it still goes to an old page, but one day they'll get around to updating everything. So I hope everyone is well. I hope your family and businesses are doing okay. Uh, if they're doing anything at all, you're, you're doing okay in this atmosphere. Uh, hopefully, you're watching this two years from now. We're all... Uh, still pissed at the government for shutting up the every business and locking us down and putting us all out of business, but um, that's a story for another day. 
Uh, good luck to you in your business. Now's a, you know, now would be a good time to reassess who's doing your marketing for you, what kind of websites you have, what your expenses are for these websites, pay-per-click advertising. Um, so it's, it's a good time to reassess things. Good luck to you.